Hey guys, a uh, couple more here. Uh, let's see. A little board play. Again, getting that four check going. Alright, so Slav, I really like that deflection. Uh, not an incredible, you know, not an unbelievable play here, but I really like the deflection. And again, that the guys are uh, able to keep the puck in on a good four check here. Last year, this player would have easily gotten that puck out um, in one pass. And again, there you go with your up and down gameplay as opposed to this, which allows you to get a keep the puck in and get some sustained uh, pressure. Um, again, you know, this year we really worked on loose pucks. Um, here, uh, uh, there's a loose puck. I poke check a bit, knock the puck out. I'm able to get in on net. And uh, I think that's Lundqvist makes an awesome save. I just like that this is hockey right here. It's a bad turnover by the defenseman and an unbelievable save by the goalie. And it's just moments like this happen in the game. And, you know, I just don't think a lot of these moments happened over the past couple of years. I think, you know, the game wasn't scripted, of course. But as you guys like to point out, you know, there's sometimes a lot of the same things start happening over game after game. And what we really worked on this year was not having, uh, you know, games that felt like they were the same type of game each time. You can get lucky bounces, turnovers, different things happening every single game. And that's really what hockey's all about is, you know, every time you go to a game, it's different and anything can happen. And that's what we're really striving for here. Oh, wrong way. So here's a board play, kick pass, um, and I come in over the line. I make a nice drop pass here. My guy kicks it up to his stick, and I go to pass to him, and he got hit by the defenseman. So again, you know, our defense is a bit more aggressive this year, making sure that um, it's, it's not an easy play to get a goal. You have to work hard. I do a really nice play here with a drop pass, kicks it up, and bad play by me. Last year, that guy probably would have been open all the time. And even that pass, uh, I know you don't want to watch these over and over and over again, but um, I drop, watch when they get the puck and go to make a play. Oh, no, I get the puck again. Let's see. Right here. And I go to make a pass, and it hits off a stick, and the Rangers get it and go out. So just kind of stuff like that uh, is, is pretty cool. Uh, here's the push puck. Um, again, we will never call this speed burst. It's simply what a player would do in real life, um, you know, when he has some opening. And um, we moved this button this year. So uh, with our new passing, we really wanted to make sure saucer pass stayed saucer pass. So we moved this to vision. If you tap vision control quickly while skating forward, you'll uh, get the push puck instead of last year, which people thought, uh, you know, they didn't know if they'd get this or saucer pass. It was a bit confusing. So we changed it to make it a bit uh, simpler. Um, here's another, uh, you know, so dump and chase. Um, this is my favorite way to play. And I could pretty much beat anyone in the studio right now playing the dump and chase style. Um, I get a really good play out of this. Um, it was actually a one-timer based on one of the created plays that, that happens automatically. Um, and my defenseman comes in here. So I dump it in. Um, there's a, See how the puck bounces here? It actually bounces over the defenseman past him. He tried to use his skate. And again, you know, with the puck that high, sometimes it's going to bounce like that. I get a nice shot of the D coming in. When I get it again here and go back to the point, uh, Lundqvist makes a nice stand-up save, which is pretty cool. So I take a slap shot here. Again, you know, being able to get rebounds and score that way. You know, I take a slap shot here. Um, I get a rebound. He makes another save. I get a second rebound and go five hole. Um, you know, I think there's more goals scored five hole this year. Um, legitimate five hole goals, not cheat goals. Um, and this is a, a good example of that as I just catch the goalie um, about to get up or move a little bit. Yeah, he was about to get up and I score five hole. Let's see, I come in here, you know, the fact that, again, good positioning matters, you know, our game's not all about checking and poking this year, you know, you, you'll you get penalties if you check at the wrong times and you poke at the wrong times, and here's an example of just being in good position on the back check, and uh, I end up, you know, picking off that pass, I dump it in, I board play, I end up getting it, I get a chance. 
Um, here's a good view from behind the goalie. Nice save. I just I think this is an insane save. Um, you know, he makes the one save. I again I get a nice rebound right there. Last year this would have been a goal. So here's another loose puck. Puck was rolling a bit, and I one time this off of a loose puck um, before I even get control of it. So puck's rolling, and I hit shoot. And again, you know, working on the loose puck one timers this year, I'm able to just take a slap shot right off that. It looks great.